What happens when you take a Gormaya fan to the Merseyside derby? One of the greatest derbies in football. To this day, the city of Liverpool is divided. One side blue, the other red. Tony has been a Gormaya fan for his whole life, but like most Kenyan football fans, he has never been to the Merseyside derby. Steve recently travelled to Kenya to attend the Nairobi derby. But now it is his turn to return the favour, to take a Kenyan to the Merseyside derby. Everton and the other team in the city are separated by less than a mile. Steve wants to show Tony just how close the two sides are. Across the other side of the park there, we have the second team of the city. Uh -huh. And as you look across here, we have the city's first team, the originals, Everton Football Club. The distance between the two grounds is half, half a mile. Half a mile, pretty yeah. close, yeah? Pretty close, yeah. But Tony wanted to visit Goodison Park before Derby Day atmosphere took over. I'm looking forward to a very terrific match, a very enjoyable match, uh, a memorable moment in my life actually, yeah, to be at Goodison Park and to witness one of the, you know, the biggest derbies in England actually. My prediction will be a draw, but right inside me, I'll be watching for Everton to win. Steve is a man of tradition. Before each game, he has a pint in the city with friends. Today, Tony is joining him. This, this is my local pub before the game. Good help. Yeah, here's to a good day. With Storm Freya giving the Derby Day something else to contend with, Steve and Tony then travel to the ground and embark on one of Steve's other traditions, pre-match fish and chips. So this is your fish, yeah? Let me get in there. Yeah. Yeah. You're going to need to make them, you're going to be bouncing up there. But Tony couldn't wear his Gormaya shirt to one of the biggest derbies in English football. This is never the shirt. With his name Tony on the back. Oh wow. Oh my sight. Fantastic. Yeah man. <laughs> Welcome to Goddison Park. Come on. The game was tense and Tony and Steve spent 90 minutes on the edge of their seats. Neither team could break the deadlock. Your nerves are shattered, mate. Everton's in my blood, it's in my bones, it's in my, it's my life. You don't choose to be an Evertonian, you know, you're chosen. For Everton fans, the draw meant it was a positive point secured against their biggest rivals. Two points up then. So Tony, we had a few good chances there today and we should have made them count. Yeah. So anyway, we've got three things in common now. Uh -huh. Everton Football Club, go Meyer. That's a family now. And Sport Pacer. Forever, yeah. Thank you for coming and I hope to see you again soon. I appreciate it so much. Thank you for coming here, mate.